What's up guys, this is Bird's got you here for a cooking video. I'm going to make some stuffed uh, peppers. I'm going to use ground turkey, tomato sauce, garlic powder, onion powder, um, maybe some Italian seasoning, Worcestershire sauce, and uh, some rice. I like the easy rice, as you know. So, buckle your seatbelt, here we go. So I didn't defall the uh, ground turkey at all. Just took it right out of the, uh, up the freezer. So I'm going to go ahead and put this in a bowl. And the to my peppers. Alright, the way I go about uh, is I just cut a square in the top here, in the top, and uh, then I'll just pull the top part off. Then you get this crap in here, and uh, you can take your knife and some, like, cut some of that out. You don't want the white parts because that's really uh, what do they say? Tart. So you want to get as much of that shit as you can. You can use a spoon, whatever. Just clear that stuff out of there. And you get the seeds out and all the uh, white parts out. It'll make a nice little cavity to put all your, your mixture in, but you don't want to poke any holes in it. So uh, be careful not to do that. So I just went over and rinsed off the uh, outside and the inside here. So we are good to go. I'm just going to make two tonight. Not making a lot, just making two. So let's go to the next step. Alright, so how I do it, you get done with the, uh, the thawing or your brand new whatever pound of uh, beef or uh, ground turkey. Throw it in a pan and start uh, frying it up. And this is the point where I will add some seasoning, maybe some uh, salt and pepper here. Get a little flavors in there. Now I get a little crazy. Put a little olive oil in. Is it like olive oil? I could drink it. Plus, I feel as though it makes the uh, the beef or whatever you're working with a little bit more tender. So uh, we'll go ahead and cook this, and uh, I'll check back if you then. We got our tomato sauce, so we'll go ahead and uh, throw that in. It's one can of uh, about 15 ounces, and uh, mix that around. And I guess this is off the top of my head, so if I think I need more, you know, throw some more in or some tomato paste or whatever, but all right. So we got that in. Now what I'll do is I'll throw the rest of my stuff in. Um, I'll put a shake. One, two, three, four, five. Shakes of uh, rosemary. Let me get the Worcestershire. And I'll go ahead and put a tablespoon of that in. One, two, three, four, five, six. A tablespoon, I guess. And then I'll get uh, about a quarter teaspoon of the uh, garlic powder. Uh, this is the onion powder. And I'll take a whole tablespoon of uh, minced garlic. This calls for garlic powder, but uh, I myself like the taste of actual garlic. So I guess that's the taste. Garlic, whatever. It's supposed to be good for you. And uh, I'll just cook this down a little bit. And uh, meet you back here in a few. Alright, so I'm uh, microwaving the rice. I'm using that uh, instant rice. But the one thing that you always want to do 
is you always want to taste your uh, what you got going on here. Mm, I need some salt. And definitely some pepper. I like pepper. And you know what? I'm gonna be a little daring today and go out. Get a little chili powder because uh, that's the kind of mood I'm in. I'll put a little chili powder in there and we'll cook it for a little bit longer. Alright, so this has been cooking for a little bit. I'm gonna give it a taste again. I'd say about four minutes. Mm. I definitely have enough rosemary. See what else I got here. A little flavor. And I'll put a little I'll put a little garlic powder in. Even though I did put garlic in, but I'm just not tasting it. Alright, so I got that in there. So uh, I'll turn this down to low. And at this point, I'll go ahead and I'll throw some fresh parsley in here pour it in the reach mix this in and I'll go ahead and throw in this bag of jasmine rice this is all I got so this is what uh, what we're getting and I'll go ahead and mix this in. I need, might need two bags, but maybe I'll go more for protein instead of. Usually, this mixture is more so rice than, um, at least in my experience, it's more rice than beef or uh, like I'm using ground turkey. So. That looks good. The mixture looks acceptable. So, at this point, I'll go ahead. After we get it mixed all the way, I'm going to go ahead and throw some cheese in here. This is just sharp cherry cheese. Two handfuls. Something to give it a little yum yum on the inside of the pepper. And then on the outside we'll also put some uh, some cheese there. So you just mix this and next we'll go ahead and mix it, uh, throw it into the uh, peppers. Alright, so here I am at the pepper station. You just want to go ahead and put the mixture into the pepper. Make sure you get it in all those areas there. So you just want to go ahead and fill both of those up. Alright, so you have to get them topped off. I put some foil on a little baking pan here. And uh, you're going to put cheese on top to finish them. Push it in there according to how much you want. Now finish this one. I guess the key why I kind of screwed up when I bought these was you, you should really try to find the flat ones. This one's uh, in danger. Danger of apocalyptic destruction of my pepper creation. Alright, so that looks good. So now pop it in the oven for about 15 minutes. Uh, about until the uh, pepper's tender, which is about 15 minutes at 350. Let's go ahead and do Alright, so let's get these out of the oven here. It's been like 17, 18 minutes. Had to cook a little bit longer. Bigger one that wasn't quite a... Wasn't quite soft. 
and you can see here that uh, it's starting to wrinkle on the sides here. So that's my indication. Anyhow, is it soft when you're pushing on it? So they look soft. Um, I had a really long uh, uh, day today, and I got like a couple hours of sleep last night. So I'm really tired. So sorry if I have a lot of energy right now, but um, is what it is. So there's an easy way to make your uh, stuffed peppers quick and easy. Cooking's not about being exact. Cooking's about taking a base recipe and adapting it to what you like. Um, so, you know, I felt like having some chili uh, powder in there today and whatever, and I just threw it in there. So, start with the base and uh, adapt it to what you want for that day. But, uh, I'll put, I guess, some description of this video, but, uh, so there's my supper. I'm hungry. Till next time, guys. Later.